My name is Diego Guerrero. I'm from, well, I'm from the Basque Country, but I live in Madrid, Spain. I am the chef and owner from this stage, uh, a restaurant in Madrid. The stage is in Madrid in, in Regueros Street, the Soho of Madrid area. When I told to my team that uh, we were going there, I showed them the, the space, the, the local was empty, and they told me that you were crazy because it was such a different uh, area than the, the one that we were before. We were very nervous about that, but um, now we find that in two years it becomes a very hot spot area. Traditionally, our roots is are very close to the gastronomy, to the people, to the chefs, or but basically to the food. From the beginning, I, I, I found that uh, I feel comfortable cooking, and and when I do my first train trainee and in a Michelin star restaurant, I found that um, that was the, what I what I want to be because I, I saw that uh, I could express myself and uh, I could find a way to, to tell the things uh, to the people. We have many sources of inspiration. For us, cooking is a way of expression, a way, a way of telling things. And the main goal for us is to transmit you our, our feelings, to do like a communication between you and I, but uh, through the dishes, okay? Apart from that, we have many sources of inspiration, for example, I can go to my roots, to my memories. So I, ha I can explain you the Tolosa ravioli beans with a cabbage uh, stock. And this automatically takes you to my country. Because in Madrid, if I do something from the Basque country, it's, it's not being local food because I am out of, from my country. So for me, it's the same that if I go to Thailand, to take something from the root, one flavor, and bring back to uh, my country. And I find that the people, you know, a lot of people has come to Thailand, especially in weddings and, <laughs> and when they say travels, and, and all of them, the couple said, wow, it was like uh, being in, in Bangkok, in, 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 I, I feel like I has um, arrived and landed in, in the Bangkok airport because the smell of the tea and what you serve is, is it's totally clear. I think that we made the guests uh, become part of the of the performance because, uh, for example, in the second snack at the, at the kitchen, we are cooking in front of them. But we start doing something that, they, first of all, they see. So we try to, do, uh, to wake up all the senses. Not only the palate, but all the senses. For example, you start seeing how we are cooking. You start to listen it because, for example, if I do some prawns in a rock of salt, and they start <laughs> So you, first of all, you see it. Second, you hear it. After that, the third, when, when I finish, you're going to eat with your fingers or you touch it. And finally, you taste it. And in, in all of this uh, road, in all of this um, time, you are sharing with, with me your opinions, to be honest, really. This is for me the most important thing. Do what, what you want to do, but be honest. Not, not make, uh, for example, not take the, the style uh, the roots, the local food, because the local food is cool. No, you have to cook the local food if you feel that this is your way. If you want to be traditional, do traditional cooking and be the best doing this. You want to do avant-garde or do it, but whatever you do, be honest with you, because if you are not, uh, the people finally is going to find you, is going to, to discover that you are lying in some way. One of the best things of this job, on this profession nowadays is if someone asks for me to define how do I see the global gastronomy, I would say that uh, for me the best thing is that everyone can do what he wants to do. To, to run a good restaurant, you don't have to put uh, table clothes uh, or, or, or the best glasses or the best weight. No, you have to do the things well and, to be, and you have to be honest with your speech, with your work. And if you do it well and of course the, the food is good and the techniques and whatever you have to use to, to do this, 
the people is going to recognize you, your work, and you are going to have a lot of success.